welcome to my dancing class. Today we're gonna do some jazz. Before we do the dancing moves and all that, well, first we're gonna have to do some stretches so you feel like so stretchy so you can like do all that stuff. Well, before we get started with our stretches, like and subscribe. Thank you. And I forgot to say, hit that notification bell. Okay, first we're gonna start with the head roll. So you're gonna first take it to the right. This is the right. Don't do hard. Now we're gonna take it to the left. Now, I'm gonna go back up for this. We're gonna take the right leg, we're gonna take it, and we're gonna reach for it. You have to tuck your ears between your arms. Just try to reach all the way to your toes. Do you guys feel real stress right here? It's very good, yeah. Now we're gonna reach for the left. Ooh, still a burn. Okay, now when we stretch there, we are gonna go in a straddle. Now, this is a straddle. You have your are your legs, they are like, try to stretch them as much as you can, but not so it hurts. We're just gonna sit a little bit in straddle, cause it's good for you. And when we wait for that, we, you guys can just like do whatever you guys want, while you guys are sitting in it. Now, when you guys are sitting in it a little, now we're gonna go in pike. So this is how pike is. You guys are gonna have you go stretch the leg, go stretch them as much as you can, right here. So they like go in. So this is how it looks now. Look at my knees. And now when you stretch them a lot, they're gonna look more flat. So we wanna do that. So first we're gonna point, and then we're gonna flex. So we're gonna have straight back, point, flex. Point, flex, point, flex. Now you guys are gonna do a jazz spin and you guys are gonna have to point your toes when you guys spin. Or, well, turn, it's a turn. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna stand up for this one and you guys are gonna reach for your toes. Reach all the way down. Now guys, you guys are kind of stretching your hamstrings, which is very important to stretch. Now, do just in case, we're gonna go and sit like this, and we're gonna reach like this. Which is gonna be opposite for us. Tuck your ears. And there we go. So, now when you guys are sitting like this, go and the butterfly. Hook your arms under here. Sit. You guys wanna have still straight. Back. Don't you guys don't wanna turn like this. And then you guys are just gonna flap your wings. There we go. Now you guys have done done your stretches. Now you guys will be good and stretchy for your dancing moves for jazz well good luck let's start with is it the jazz spin well it's a turn so first thing we're gonna start with is we're gonna take our hands we're gonna go out like this you want your shoulders to be relaxed and your arms to be just straight First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your right leg, you're gonna take it to the side, then you're gonna take your right arm, put it in the front, and take your right leg in the back. This is called a 
plie. You want to go deep in that plie so you can pop up and go around. First, we're going to do is we're going to practice standing in it. So first, we're going to do straight arm, relaxed leg, and take your leg to the side. You want it to be straight, and this is your supporting leg. You want it to be very straight when you take and when you go around. So this here, this leg, when you go with this and you're going to pop up, you're going to take your arms, they're going to be in the middle of your stomach and your waist. They're going to be in the middle and you're going to pop up. Your left leg is going to be on toes and your right leg is going to go all the way up to the knee when it's about the same level but not touching. So we're going to try to do it. Step one. Relaxed shoulders and straight arms. Then we're gonna go in a deep plie and pop up. So we're gonna do it a couple times. You guys can pause the video and try a couple times. So one, two, pop up. So you want it your right leg to stay in the same position. When you pop up, it should be up here so it should be kind of like this then like this then it should be kind of the same when you come up so it's gonna be two times the same so like this that's one thing this go to the pie and go up so now we're gonna try to do the turn so to do the turn you're gonna do the exact thing so you're gonna pop up and turn so, we're gonna do step one, go in that deep, deep plie. Then we're gonna pop up. So try to have your foot right on the left leg's knee. You want it to be on the same level. So, we're gonna do step one, step two. Remember your arms should be in the middle of the waist and the stomach. I'm not as good because I haven't been doing it so long. I have started in a couple of weeks now. So, I'm going to be best. So, step one, you want to have always stretch the back, relax shoulders, straight arms and legs. And you want this one to always be on the right side. Before you go to the... the the play, you want this one to go, the right arm to go out. You take the right leg to go down into the deep plie. And then pop up and spin. The first thing you guys want to do is a couple of days practice doing this part. Just hold for about two seconds. So now that we have finished that, you guys can pause the video and practice. Now I'm going to learn you guys a simple one. It's called the jazz squat. It's very simple. You take your right leg first. You take it in front. You can have your arms on your hips or out to the side. I'm going to do it on the hips because it's pretty easy. So right leg in front. Your left leg is going to go in front and cross and then your right leg is gonna go behind again then your left leg is gonna go on the side now what you're gonna do is we're gonna practice on this one now we take it in the side your left one gonna go on is front your right leg is gonna go across your left leg again just the same just other way okay well now your right leg is gonna go across the well guys thanks for watching and you guys have to make sure you guys see my next jazz class next week and i'll see you guys there i now we're gonna try to do it a little quicker so right leg go to the front left leg will go across in the front your right leg will go back 
behind it and you want it to be straight line and your left leg should go across like this now i gotta show you some other scales so this here is called pony so you're gonna have one arm up and you're gonna have this leg the left leg should be should be always pointed and it should be like this so when you when this one goes down the right one goes bending this one should be up in the air um so it should be pointed like this and then when this one should goes up then this one should go up. so it's gonna be kind of be like jumping so like that and you guys can try to do it with your left leg then you guys are gonna switch but it's gonna be the same so just like this kind of like riding a pony and it's called pony so it's kind of like riding a horse now what we're gonna do is called Sinead turn Sinead is very easy you guys are gonna have some space in between your legs then you guys are gonna go across here so you guys don't crash and you're gonna take the left leg gonna go across the right leg should go across like this so this is how it looks when you go a little faster that's kind of how it should look you guys can do little shenades if you guys wanna then it should be looking like this just that it won't be as much space now what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to do fan so this is the last step and we're gonna so when you guys are doing fan i usually kick with my left leg like this then I take right and does this then I take the right leg again and it goes around it goes behind your right hip should be facing towards and then you should be going backwards like this now when i do this to get back up you guys are gonna stretch them out like this you guys are doing gonna go up here and have always pointed 